Sonic, are you okay? Man, I can't believe you made it through that. I like you thought I wouldn't. The only thing I was thinking about was getting pushed into an elevator. Well, a hedgehog's gotta do what a hedgehog's gotta do. Great job, Sonic. Thanks, but I had a little help during that last part. Saving us. Uh, he says you are welcome. That thing's translating pretty good. Yep, I finally got all the kinks out. We can talk to them perfectly now. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh boy. He says goodbye, my friends. I have to go. <laughs> Just when I got this thing working. Better late than never, buddy. That was Sonic Colors, everyone. I hope you enjoy the playthrough. Now, I understand that I am talking through the credits. Well, this is also a good song. You can find this on YouTube. Sonic Colors, uh, soundtrack. It is basically, reach for the stars, speak with your heart. A lot of good games come with this, come with this, uh, well, music comes with this game. Now, I understand that I have been, this is my very first well, I would say first project of the new year. Now, I hope to understand, realize that this was a, a very dedicated game to myself. It has been a few years since I basically played this game. Let me turn this down a bit more. This game is by far one of my best Sonic games. Well... To be honest, I've never played a single Sonic game till Generations, well, since the Unspeakable Generation, Unspeakable Sonic 06. Now, things start looking up when I did get my hands on Sonic Unleashed. And then for Christmas, I got Sonic Generations. I s believe I got this game before Generations, but... To be honest, why I didn't go 100% out of my way is because I do not have the time to do so. I did this as a um, memory of some sort. Now, it, it's basically a memory of a lot of things, how I basically play the game. So, I'm not a diehard Sonic fan. I literally enjoy gate platforms like this. So, this is how it's going to, how it's been. The entirety of the Nintendo Wii was basically my pinnacle of games that I literally did not play or expect to experience. It was back back when the Nintendo when we had the Nintendo Wii well my parents had it. We basically only had Mario Galaxy One, Mario Kart Wii, and Wii Sports. It wasn't until uh I believe two thousand and eight or so, I got my hands on Sonic Colors. I do have some of the old... I do have Mario Galaxy 1, and I do have Mario Galaxy 2. But I don't know if I will be basically recording these games due to Nintendo copyright. Now, this is a Sega game, so I have all... So I can basically record all Sega games all I want without any remorse. Though, it does come with a heavy price. I'm limiting myself to a current to certain number of games. But that doesn't stop me from enjoying some good ones. As you know, as you are aware, back in October 2016, my channel received a big huge update of backlog, meaning that when Titanfall 2 launched, I basically got the game and played it immediately day 1 after installing it. Now, I'm going to be clear, I actually told myself I would basically record the game via console 
because apparently I just now realize that my PC doesn't is uh, has a stuttering effect when recording from the con from Titanfall 2. It's very annoying to do so, but it hasn't bothered me since for a while. Though upgrading progress, upgrading is still in a work of progress, and the reason why I haven't been playing as much Titanfall 2 content, I'm very sorry of those that actually do enjoy that content. However, the console content is going to be delayed for some quite some quite time because even though I like playing on the console, I've dedicated most of my time on console to Dark Souls as well as I believe some Nintendo games. Now, I'm going to lay this clear and out. Some Nintendo games like the remake of Twilight Princess will not be shown. However, I will be showing its predecessor. The regular Nintendo Wii version of Twilight Princess. No HD remakes at all. So that's part of my backlog. And uh, yes. Not to mention that I am going to be doing... I'm still doing Dark Souls 2. Though I will have to sit down and get around to that. Now why am I talking through Sonic Colors' uh, credits? Well, this is the only time I could do so. Now keep in mind that I have stopped playing Halo 5 Guardians because it's well, it's a personal thing with 343 did. As well as a lot of other things that I am failed to believe, but I just now realized at the time of this recording that they removed the campaign. And I was going to show the campaign of Halo 5 Guardians. Now, if everyone want now if I get some good response on this credit scenes below, I will basically come back to this game and I will collect every red ring out of out of my pain and I will show off the bonus content. And yes, I'm going to spoil this game to those that actually have actually played this game. Sonic Colors the Nintendo Wii version I don't have the th I don't have the regular DS, which is Sonic Rush 3, to a certain re reviewer. This is basically the prize is Super Sonic for the Nintendo Wii version, basically invincibility. It's the same as the 360 generations with the with the ring count meter and everything. Also, another game that might that will be coming to the future. Uh, I have not announced it yet, so keep it out for that, because it is a very rare Xbox 360 game. It was launched in uh, 2008, so keep your eyes out for that. I will be enjoying that game. Uh, it'll come out at, the, at a later time. As well as, I will finally get my, hand, my uh, get around to... The Halo Master Chief Collection, seeing that it is one of my favorite games still to this day, as well as uh, StarCraft II's Nova Covert Ops. Oh, I gotta keep that up. Now, keep in mind that a lot of things will be changing. As you can fully aware, you have you seen some of my videos lately? I've that have basically been published already. Are World of Warships? Yes, I've been playing that game. I'm. To be honest, I'd rather play a Warships game than a World of Tanks because I, because World of Warships has a playstyle that I'm very used to. Strategic, methodical stuff. Sometimes World of Tanks can have that, but it's a little bit too fast-paced for my liking. I'm looking at a lot of stuff. Though I am also looking forward to getting my hands on a PlayStation 3 because why not? I've never had a PlayStation in my entire life. I mean, just when I got Sonic Colors, I was in I was getting into the Xbox 360. Well, Microsoft. A little late than that because I started out Halo with Halo 2 on the regular Xbox, the very first one, not Xbox 1. So I was late to the Xbox family in my ninth grade of high school back in 2004. As well as a lot of other things. You got, apparently I have published Battleship Thir Surface Thunder. 
it's a very rare and unique arcade game. I thought it was published in 2005. I was wrong. That was that six of one family games that you got. So, yeah. Now, to be honest, I'm going to say this as well. I do not have a way of recording any of the handheld Nintendo games, so do not expect that from me at all. Or the Nintendo Wii games. I will stream them, but I won't do any recording with them. Just uh, keep that in a heads-up reminder for the near future. If I do somehow manage to record some Nintendo Wii U games, I'm not doing it for, for anyone. I'm just going to probably do it for a special project or something like that. But yeah, this has been uh, Sonic Colors and a lot of other games to come. Now, this wasn't my big project, like my StarCraft, my StarCraft days. But keep in mind, I'm still going to do the regular StarCraft like, I'm talking about the regular StarCraft for the PC. I have found a way to record it. And I will be recording it. It's another dear memory of mine. And here's how it's going to go. I will be playing every mission without using cheats. I, I know I can do it. But it it depends on my um, way of getting, up, getting off my butt and doing a lot of things. So, as I say, keep it out, out for that in some time in the near future. I do not know when I'm going to get to it, but I do say that it is also there. It's the first game, the first real RTS game I've played to date. So, StarCraft is still up there. So, since uh, also but on the topic of StarCraft, since the launch of Legacy of the Void, I have not done a single StarCraft match for a while. And that's my own fault that's my own reason because i haven't been playing as much starcraft since uh heart of the swarm I, i'm i mean i can i'm still there but running into me is a uh, very uh very elusive since every zerg and terran and protoss and player that out there seem to run into me know how i play but it'll come at a later time also I do believe that I will not be touching World of Warcraft as well. Time sync, do not want to, do not want, do not want, and do not want. However, I believe there is one game that I can possibly record. It basically was both for the Wii U the, and the Xbox One. Uh, I will not be showcasing the Wii U version because it is does it does not bode well with the game. It's mechanics. I mean, it's a nice game. The soundtrack is good. I'll give it that, but it's not a game for me to play here and there. Even though you got it for f in back in about a couple years ago, it was free on the Xbox One Live Arcade. I think that covers about everything. But, yeah, so, I think I may also be uh, showing some Titanfall 2 console version. Now, keep in mind, I'm looking at you, Keeper, especially, that I play, in Titanfall in general, if you will always see me in Atlas Chassis Titans, like Ion or Tone, those are the two Titans that I can basically deal damage and I know how to still play them. PC version, you're going to automatically see tone out of me because I'm not a tryhard. I just know how to punish those. I do have some famili fam familiarities using Scorch because it's my least my least Titan to use. I've al I've already shown that in a previous video. But when you see me use tone. You're going to probably get a very unwelcome uh, gameplay from me. Because if I'm facing another one of you in a tone, I will, will beat you. Without any backup you give me. But, 
I've, but apparently this, uh, the credits are coming to a close, so I hope you all enjoy the last cutscene of Sonic Colors, and I will see you in the next video. You have yourself a good day and a good night. Silence of space right about now. Sushi, hey, I heard they started using fish. Bobby, we didn't bring any with us. Not that we can eat it since we're robots, but we kind of looked at it. I love looking at stuff. I love stuff. The fireworks show the English great. Hey, how did you get all this stuff to blow up like that anyway? Loved it. By the way, I just got dogs. Sorry. Where are we going?